Hey guys, it's me, James, with This Beautiful Crazy Life. Uh, I want to do a quick video real quick here. Um, right now, I'm in the beautiful city of Dallas, Texas, um, in this pretty nice little hotel room here. And, and what I wanted to, oops, <laughs> actually, so what I want to talk about is this here. Um, I hope you guys can hear me. I'm using my phone mic and just use, so this is a, a little difficult, but I'm, I have this, like, this big idea a takeaway I had this last, really these last couple weeks has been this idea of legacy. So right now I'm at this conference called uh, Mosaic Through and Through Young Life. And that word kept coming to mind. And then today it really solidified for me is what are we passing down to our next generation, our community, the people we know? What is the legacy that we are leaving to those who know us, to those around us? If you die today, if your organization disappeared, if your church disappeared, would people truly grieve and feel a loss by you not being there and providing the impact you do? And would it be an opportunity if that was to happen where other people inspired by what you did stepped up and did more? I say this because I was at a New Year's party and two friends of mine, older, you know, their grandparents, business owners, they love Jesus, they have impact in so many places they go. I was looking around sitting in their beautiful home and their beautiful marriage with their kids and their grandkids and their lifelong friends and me being there and our, and my friends and our kids and just like, you have four generations of people in this one home. And I was like, wow, I hope when I get to that age, that is what my home looks like. And then today at Young Life, we recognize two people who have served Jesus and this organization in many different ways for 25 and 30 years. And just to hear the impact that they created. And so let me ask you something. Is that what your life is leading up to? Yesterday, we were driving around Dallas and, you know, you see all these giant buildings and they're beautiful and they're interesting and the city's pretty cool, you know? And you look and you see all the cars going by and there's all these people living in there. And you see the streets and the freeways and all that stuff. And there's so much activity going on. But you know, all this stuff, these roads will one day not be here. The buildings will no longer be there, right? They'll be gone. It will be places, new roads, new buildings. And then new people. People that we don't imagine what their lives would be like 100 years from now. But let me ask you, many of those kids will be our descendants those buildings may not last, but will the values that we pass on last? So I leave you guys with that. I hope you guys have a good day. I need to go get checked out and go on my flight. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord shine his counts upon you and be gracious to you.